Yo, what's up guys? Out here skating at El Sereno today. Today I'm meeting up with Killian Martin who's over there. You guys haven't really seen him on the channel before. Yeah, Killian, like Andy, is an amazing freestyle skater. He's not even skating his freestyle board right now. Yeah. Quick feet. Super sick. Oh my god. You got that, Killian. Oh my God. So close. Perfect, dude. Just, I just want to see, can you try one more just to see if you could do two in a row? Just for YouTube's sake. <laughs> I always like to see consistency in skaters and, you know, just so you guys can see as well. Oh, oh my God, he had two in a row. Dude, that was so sick, Killian. Yeah, so Killian, this is my first video with you. I'm just gonna do like a quick interview, you know? Okay, just so people get to know you a little bit better. Yeah. You just started talking about how Bruce Lee is like, you know, someone who inspires you, Yeah. you know? And for me, that's the same. For Paul Rodriguez, it's the same. Like Paul's actually the one who kind of like got me into him. So uh, what are some of like, can you remember some of the sayings that like kind of inspired you that he- well, uh, One of the things that I like is that when they call him a superstar, right? Yeah. And how he says that I'm not a star, right? We're all under the same, uh, we're all human. Yeah. And one of the things I was just telling my wife that it totally goes with skateboarding. When he says, like, are you gonna do Kung Fu fighting or Chinese fighting? What are you gonna do? And, it's, and how he says that styles tend to separate, right? And it's like, we all have like two arms and two legs. It's all the same. So I feel like it's the same with skateboarding. You'll say, oh, freestyle, you're on the freestyle, you're on the street, vert. It's all just a board. It's all right? skateboarding. It's all skateboarding. And you can just, <laughs> if you say, I'm just gonna do freestyle. Well, what's wrong with doing some obstacles? I understand not wanting to do big steps and things like that, but it's a lot of fun doing all kinds of skateboarding, at least in my opinion. Anyone can choose to do whatever they want. Obviously. I completely agree, man. I feel like if you skate everything and kind of dibble and dabble in all of it, then it kind of opens you up yeah. and you have more fun. Yeah. You know, in the beginning, it might be scary, you know, because for me, totally. it's like I'm starting to skate rails like and it's like really scary, but I'm getting more and more comfortable. Yeah. And I think pushing your boundaries and trying scary stuff is very important. Yeah. So when, when it comes to like being creative, if I just, if I'm just doing flat ground, there's really so much you can do. Mm -hmm. And you can get creative obviously, because especially with freestyle, you can come up with anything and be like, oh, I just did it. No one's ever done it before, right? But then when you add some obstacles with it, it just opens a whole different way of skating where you can just even add those freestyle tricks doing an obstacle and becomes new. Exactly, like what you just did on the quarter pipe. You know what I mean? I've never seen that. And I know most of the viewers probably haven't seen that. So it's a way for you to stand out. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it's not to be like, oh, I want to be different, but I don't know, whenever. And we obviously, we all learn from each other's tricks because like I was just watching a skater the other day and he did a trick and I was like, that's incredible. But I'm not looking to do the same trick. I'm looking to use what he did and add something. Yes. Uh, so the inspiration. Yeah. Yeah, I love that, man. So I get inspired by everyone, you know. Yep. <laughs> man, I'm so hyped we we skated today. Thank I'm sure yeah, we'll be skating a lot in the future. I'm a big so. fan of your stuff. So awesome, happy to be man. With you. Yeah, it's kind of funny because we've tried to skate together before with Andy. Yeah. But for some reason I couldn't make it, you know, I was going through something or, you know, the, the last year was really crazy for me. I'm really okay. good now, but you know, awesome. it's, it's perfect timing, dude. Cause I, I pretty much go out and skate almost every day. That's awesome. So. Yeah. I want to skate more. Awesome. I want to be more disciplined, skate more. That's yeah. part of like living here. That's why I you mean, wanted to move to LA. Yeah. That's a part of it. So, you know, it's still hard, but it's not unhumanly possible. Like it's not <laughs> at all. It's uh, you know, you just gotta, skate certain things for a certain amount of time Drink water. and then stop yeah exactly like train your body so i'm looking forward to it and um 
just literally getting just a spot right by my house and sometimes going early just skate you know yeah that's what me i love skating early yeah so i'll wake up at like today i woke up at six okay that's good went to the beach went for a walk and then you know i knew i was coming to meet up with you so i just came to meet up with that's you perfect yeah yeah, yeah so we, next time we can skate earlier yeah i'm down dude i love it i know awesome. today you had a skate lesson yeah so, so that's what i've been doing because in arizona i had like about six students mm -hmm. but i was only teaching from like november to may because mm -hmm. In May, the kids start being like, it's too hot, I can't think. <laughs> so then it's like, well, what am I going to do? So, so I was hoping like here, I'm, throughout the year, I can do skate lessons. Well, that's awesome. We're talking about this now too. So then I can put a link in the description for you. So yeah, if anyone okay. wants skate lessons from Killian, yeah. he is open. <laughs> I always like, I, I feel like I do it a little bit different than other people because I focus on tricks right away on the first lesson, like easy yeah. tricks, seven, eight tricks. Mm -hmm. And then I make a video with every lesson to keep track of what they've done. Oh, that's so smart. And then smart. I send it to the parents uh, or, you know, if they're older, then I send it to them and I put it with music. So I make an edit from every skate lesson. Wow. And then they send it to others. Oh, look what my kid can do. And that gets me more lessons. Dude, that's genius, dude. Props. Thank you. Well, sick, bro. I mean, that's five minutes of an uh, interview right oh, there, perfect. so we can chill and get some more tricks and uh, see what we get. <laughs> oh, that's good. No way! <laughs> oh, man. You got it. Right here. Getting artsy over here. Oh. There we go. Try another one, Kelly, and just see if you can get two in a row. <laughs> Sorry for messing you up. <laughs> Wow, yeah, dude. <laughs> Damn. Oh, you got two in a row? <laughs> I love seeing how consistent these guys are. There it is. I was sick, dude. Jeez, two in a row like nothing. <laughs> Jeez, I almost got in the way and he still did it. What? The heel grab was sick. I can't say I've ever seen that before. What the heck? I've never seen that before, dude. Dang, dude. Wow. That was a really good impossible. <laughs> I love freestyle skating, dude. It's so sick. That's right, Killian. Killian's killing it. Whoa! I love when the wheels make that sound. <laughs> Next try, dude. Yeah.
got it, bro. That's so close. Yo, what's up, guys? So, at the end of every day that me and Killian skate together, he's going to teach me a combo or a trick. Mainly freestyle stuff, right? Yeah, because it's easy to learn some of those tricks. Okay, cool. And also, this is like, he, he likes to teach people and like he does lessons. So if you're in the LA area, be sure to hit him up. There's a link in the description below and uh, come out and learn some stuff with Killian. All right, bro, what you got for me? So here's a simple one. Obviously, if, here's the simplest if you've never skated before. Cool. This is the simplest. Thing. Well, let's just act like I've never skated before. Okay. So here's, here's one. One. Two. Three. Four. Cool. It's four steps, and when you switch it, one. This foot to this foot, you can put a little bit on on the ground. Yeah. So you're in balance. Yeah. You can put this one in the ground. Yep. So one, two, three. Four. So they're marked with the little jump through. Cool. One, two, three, four. All right. I better be able to do this first try. <laughs> Here, come and film. Okay, so you start off like this. I'm going to start on the ground. Okay. One, two, three, four. Okay, good. But yeah. you can... Let's see if you can do it hopping a little more from hopping. one to the other. Okay, okay. Two, three, four. Yeah, that's it. What's up? <laughs> Look who's the best teacher ever. <laughs> okay, now you're gonna try in the. On the, the concrete? Concrete. All right, I gotta so, see you do it first. So we do it here and then in the concrete. And okay. I'll show you how you can step it up, basically not putting the other foot on the ground. So it's just hovering? Yeah, so one, two, Three, four. One, All right. Two, three, four. I think I got that. So while you're skating around, while you're skating around. Yeah. Okay. Let me so let, let me try. Skated, that's pretty cool, huh? Yeah, that's pretty. That's super sick. Are you kidding me? That's super sick. I mean, I know how to skate. Oh no, no, no. I don't know how to skate. Yes, you do. <laughs> okay, let's see. Okay. So. Perfect. Switch, bro. I got a switch. Yeah. yeah. Skate lessons with Killian. Hit him up. Descriptions in the, uh, or <laughs> info's in the description. Yeah, man. Let's skate. <laughs>